Hi everyone. At the moment the United Kingdom is on lockdown because of the coronavirus. As a result, we can only leave our homes if it's to buy essentials or exercise, for example, walking, running or cycling. Now I've, I'm on my bike at the moment and I'm going to be going around the perimeter road of Glasgow Airport. I've got a couple of sad sights to show you. Fly B were experiencing financial troubles at the start of this year. The sudden drop in demand was the last straw and the airline went into administration. The chances of selling any of these aircrafts in the short to medium term is slim. Until a buyer can be found, they just sit here at the edge of the runway. This is a favourite location at the northeast end of the airport. It's a good place to watch the large birds take off and land. Great place to do some plane spotting or even photography. Um, there's absolutely no one here at the moment. A couple of cyclists going by, but otherwise no cars because there's no flights. Absolutely nothing. I tell a lie, there was a Logan Air flight which arrived this morning from Stornoway and that's since left. Otherwise, nothing here. Uh, we're under Presswick air traffic control here and we usually get the transatlantic flights flying from continental Europe across here over to North America. I can't remember the last time I saw a vapour trail. I've got Flight Radar 24 app on my mobile phone here. Uh, there's absolutely nothing happening over Scotland at the moment. There's a couple of uh, helicopters buzzing around Aberdeen, but that's mainly because of the North Sea oil rigs. There's a light aircraft flying around Perth. It's obviously a training flight, but absolutely nothing. No transatlantic flights, and I can see the so I can see the Logan Air flight which left about an hour ago from Glasgow Airport. Apart from that, nothing. Right, let's move around to the other side of the uh, the runway. I've got something really, really sad to show you. Sadly, Rolls-Royce have just announced some pretty hefty job losses. Uh, they're probably the world leader in aircraft engines, and with no flights operating, or very few flights operating, demand for engines and repairs and spare parts has just plummeted. I'm not sure if that's a plane spotter's idea of heaven or sheer hell. I should point out as well, I, I spotted the Hercules aircraft arriving and taking off at Glasgow Airport. I sort of assumed it was maybe bringing personal protection equipment for the NHS here in Scotland, but it was actually uh, the RAF using the empty runways as a practice area for landings and takeoffs. This is one of the most amazing aviation sites I've ever seen. It's time to go around to the other side of the airport. I'm walking up to the airport terminal now. The airport bus from Glasgow just passed, double-decker bus, not one single passenger on it. Wow, this is eerie.
Well, that marks the end of a rather somber trip around Glasgow Airport. Hopefully the world will get back to normal, whatever the new normal will be, and I can start using my Glasgow Airport as a gateway to the world. Anyway, everybody, keep safe. We'll see each other at the other side.